friends welcome to beauty infinite so today's video is a much much requested video so you guys have been requesting me to do a makeup collection video for a very long time and i know i'm really sorry that i have been delaying it a bit because my makeup collection has been seriously disorganized but finally i went ahead and organized them and i thought why not do this video without further delay and yeah today i'm gonna go ahead and share my updated makeup collection with you guys now before i start with the video there is a small disclaimer which i would like to inform first of all i do have a big collection but i do not owe a huge or humongous collection like many beauty bloggers over youtube if you are looking forward for a collection which will include a lot of fancy brands then this is not a collection for you because my collection mostly consists of brands which are drugstore indian drugstore and as well as international drugstore as well not a lot but few i do not or any sort of extreme branded product internationally like Benefit or Chanel or Anastasia. I do not owe them. Not the least, if you are someone who do not like to watch this sort of a video, you can definitely go ahead and skip the video and watch some other video from my channel. But if you are someone who really like to watch makeup collection and do enjoy this sort of a video are most welcome to watch this because I love watching makeup collection. That's why I'm sharing this and I received a lot of requests for you guys and that is also another reason for this sharing all in good note i'm not sharing this video to show off to anyone neither to prove any sort of negative impact please do not take it otherwise it's in very positive and a good note now with all that hoo-ha i think i'm going to stop because i don't want to make this introduction unnecessary long because i think the video is going to be quite a long so i will request you guys to go and grab a snacks a tea or a coffee of your choice sit back and relax and watch the makeup collection this is the first shelf on the left hand side i keep all my perfumes and deodorants I have many random brands and I love to collect them like Hugo Boss, Imari Seduction, then Little Black Dress, then just brands like Temptation, Joven Mask, Joven Mask, Lomani. Then on the right hand side I keep some random products which are used almost daily basis like the Patanjali Avocado Scrub, then I have the Himalaya Neem Face Wash. Then I have the Dabur Gulabari Gulab Gel. I do have this Jack Olive Oil. I use this olive oil to remove my eye makeup and it works really really well in terms of cleaning my eyes. Then I have the Lotus Basil Tone Toner. Then the Neutrogena Deep Clean Face Wash. My VLCC Eye Cream. I love this Khadi Mint and Aloe Vera Gel which is very refreshing and hydrating in terms of my skin especially when I return from my work. It just refreshes my face so well. It's extremely soothing. I keep my Johnson baby powder in this large container. And then I have this Imari Seduction Skin Softener. I love this one, especially I love to use it after I've done a pedicure or manicure. Then I have few Q-tips. This is what comprises of the first shelf. Then on the second shelf, I keep all the products on the right hand side and left hand side I have few books. I have most of my bath products here. I have the Himalaya Protein Hair Cream, then the Avon Natural Exfoliating Bar Soap. Then I also have this new Himalaya Cucumber and Coconut Soap which I haven't used yet. I have two of this Luster Wine and Orange Body Scrub. They are really good and extremely nice and mild in terms of cleansing your body. Then I have a lot of body washes because I absolutely love to use body washes. Like I owe the Fiamma Duvelis. Then Avon. I love this uh, sensual body, natural body, herbal body wash. It's a black currant flavor, and I absolutely love it. Then on the right hand section, I keep keep some of my the oils which I use, like the parachute hot oil, the Kyocarpin herbal body oil. My favorite one is the Vertoli olive oil, which is extremely good for my skin. This is pure and mild olive oil the next section of the makeup is kept in this cupboard and few on the top of the cupboard and this is what it looks from outside so 
So in this glass bowl on the top of the cupboard I keep all my small nail polishes like L18, Avon, all mini nail polishes in this beautiful box which is pretty old now but I keep all my scrunchies which I use on daily basis. I've made this DIY candle holder with my glass bangles. I just kept uh, random bangles around uh, this uh, short candles in short glasses and yeah they look pretty nice and I can even use the bangles whenever I want to. Then in the first rack of this cupboard I have all this product on the right hand section I have like all my hair products the first one is a Patanjali almond oil it is really nice and good in terms of your hair then I have the Habib's uh, hair serum I owe two of this mini size B Blunt spotlight hair polisher and the B Blunt dry shampoo they are great in terms of traveling so I love the travel size version then I have the Livon Moroccan hair serum I do love the Dove Elixir hair oil because this is really nice in giving a smooth effect on the hair. Then I have the Soul Flower Castor Oil, the Vela Oil Reflection Serum. Then I do owe some of the Bee Blunt hair sprays and hair products like the Bee Blunt Curling Hair Cream, the Bee Blunt Climate Control Cream, the FX Moroccan Moisture Argan Oil. I love the Bee Blunt Climate Control Cream a lot. Then this is a Bee Blunt Blown Away Voluminizing Leave-In Spray. This is great in terms of my hair since my hair is pretty thin. Then I have this Nova Hair Fixer which is just a random one. Then I have this Gatsby Hair Fixer which is really great in terms of keeping your hair fixed at a place. I love the Taft Hairs Fixer. This is really good and hold your hair for a very long time. Then I have the Tony and Guy Heat Protection Spray and yeah this is really good and then I also have the Sun Silk Heat Protection Spray as well. I do not use this one a lot. Mostly I use the Tony and Guy. Then I buy then I have bought this pink trays from Amazon.in and I keep a lot of products on there. First one is a Cetaphil hydrating moisturizing cream then I have three of my sunscreen at the back Lotus VLCC and Lacme I do not use the Lacme one quite a lot then I also have the Blossom Kochar Aroma Magic Sunscreen which is a natural based sunscreen this is my hand cream which is from the brand Plum and it's my absolute favorite this is a Niju Apple Moisture Hand Cream and is very nice then I have the Nivea Sun Protection SPF 50 which is great for sun protection as well then I have these two holders in the first holder which I'm showing I keep all my colored coats and lip liners yes they have all the colored coats and lip liners and even highlighter pens I have like brand Maybelline, MUA, Revlon, L'Oreal, Lacme all random brands in there and yeah I keep them all together then in the second holder I keep all my kajal, pen eyeliners and brow eyebrow pencil. Again I have random brands in there like Lacme, Colossal, then uh, Maybelline Hyper Sharp, Streetwear. Then I have this Avon uh, liner and yeah pretty much. Then I have the Eba Halal foundation which I hardly use. Then I have the Soul Flower uh, Lavender Essential Oil, the Vana Vidhi sunscreen which is a shimmer sunscreen bro uh, provided by fab bag then I have all my hairspray in the front the first one is from fab India the next is from Khadi then at the back I have my Iba halal hair spray it's not hair sorry facial spray then I have my plum uh, matte moisturizer and my Kama Ayurveda rose water then I have my colorescence aqua makeup base and yeah colorescence illuminator which I hardly use then I have my colorescence high definition powder which I love but I hate the brush then I have this dove mirror which was a free gift then I have the Lacme rose powder and the Palmer coca butter formula which I absolutely love this is a beauty blender which I keep out here which I use on daily basis and two of my Maybelline creme blushes which I use on daily basis and I absolutely love then I have this hair wax which is sort of a hair gel and my streetwear compact on this particular tray. This is a clear polish and an extra lacme remover on the same tray. Then I bought this organizing drawer from Amazon.in. The first drawer consists of my BB and CC cream. I have like Garnier, Pons, Faces, Lacme, Fair and Lovely, Inbeda. 
Then in the second drawer, I have all my concealers and two of my mousse foundation from Color Bar and Maybelline. I also have the LA Tint foundation there. I have random brand like LA Girl, then uh, Oriflame, Maybelline, um, MUA, Makeup Revolution. Those two sponges are for cleaning the containers. So yes, they are only for cleaning purpose. Then on the third drawer, I have my watches and two of my false eyelashes. I have only two because I don't use them a lot. I'm still practicing and working on them. So yeah. And the next drawer consists of all my cuff earrings and those. this box consists of all my rings. And the final drawer consists of all my anklets. I love to wear anklets so I have quite a lot of them in this particular drawer. I keep my few of my lip balms in this Gravitel cardboard box. I haven't DIY it yet because I haven't done a separate review of this product. That is why I have random brands like uh, Nivea, Maybelline, lots of Vaseline, Avon. I love this particular flavor from Nivea which is in guava and it has a yummy smell. Do try it out if you haven't tried it yet. This particular pouch consists of all my nail art stuff. It I have a lot of small... Uh, stones and glitters and I absolutely love this cutesy packaging and yeah these are like all my nail art stuff which I keep in this bag and I love this nail art will which has like really cute flowers uh, for decorating your nails. The final shelf consists of my skincare product, my shampoos and my hair tools. Uh, I have like a Babyliss uh, and a Remington curler and a wand and a Philips straightener and a Philips uh, dryer i keep my loofahs and bath glove in this plastic packet so that they doesn't drip water once they are wet and they stay well in that way then i keep all my pedicure and manicure stuff in this particular pouch I've kept all my tissues in this cardboard case. This is just a random cardboard case which I received from Flipkart and it has all my tissue boxes. I have like Cleo, then Cara, then I have this pack of uh, pocket tissues and this is really handy. I carry just one of its pack when I'm going outside. Each of this pack consists of 10 pieces. Then I have this Chico cleansing wipe which I again use as a makeup removing wipes. Then I keep all my curling clips and my curlers in this particular plastic case and yeah in this plastic bag i keep rest of my hair tools like my buns uh, bumpets some shower caps some few random stuff uh, which i keep in this the first one is a tresemme backup and the second one is a tresemme bottle i'm currently using then this is a dove hair therapy hair shampoo then the next one is my uh, Tresemme Smooth and Shine Conditioner. Then next to it I have a small head and shoulder bottle. Then I have a Himalaya Protein Hair Cream Backup and a Detol Hand Wash and the Sea Soul Candle which came with the Fab Bag. This is a Luster Radiance Gold Cream which I use during facial. It's great in terms of massaging on your skin skin then i have the gravitel scrub which i absolutely love and it is really nice for the skin then i have a massage oil from soul flower which i recently purchased then i have few of my nail art tools in here and few of the nail art colors as well i also have few of my pedicure and manicure tools as well then on the left hand side on this tray i keep all my skincare product i have like my all my face pack this is oceania face scrub which came with fab bag then that is my biotech clay mask then i have this avon natural oil control uh, gel and this peel off mask which i love my johnson and johnson baby oil then i have this uh, just her body luster which i really really love but i'm not getting the time to use this once i do i will do a review then all my just her face wash and face scrub but my ever youth scrub pretty much all my uh, skincare products are there at the back i have all my moisturizer like my eba halal my favorite patanjali aloe vera gel yeah this is like my second tube and i absolutely love it then i have the vaseline keep my makeup on a shelf in my closet white tray consists of all my blushes I will, the first one I have like Lakme 9 to 5 then Essence Heat Web Blusher 
then I have like Blue Heaven, Blue Heaven, Maybelline, Makeup Revolution, Makeup Revolution, Makeup Revolution, Rimmel, Rimmel, then Color Essence, Faces, then the front one is Miss Claire, yeah, and that is pretty much kitchen tray which has four different cases for keeping separate products on the left hand side i keep my big earrings and in that small white box i keep my minute or smaller earrings but since it is not a jewelry collection i'm not going into details if you want a video separately on jewelry please let me know in the comment section below on this right hand case i keep all my gel liners my liquid liners my bullet from kajals and yeah and also my duraline because i use it mostly for my eye products i have like lotus color essence maybelline soul tree l18 maybelline gel liner l'oreal gel liner streetwear blue heaven and yeah pretty much all random brand and also l18 and the blue heaven artisto kajal as well a worn pretty much almost all my kajals and eyeliner new music flower gel liner which i purchased the next case at the back of my liner I keep all my primer except this Lacme Absolute Mousse. I have like a e.l.f. Pr a primer which I mostly use as a highlighter. Random brands like uh, Miss Claire, Savannah, Oriflame. Then I keep all my bottle foundation in this particular case. I have like Maybelline Fit Me, 324 L'Oreal Infallible. Then a Faces, Lacme Perfecting. Perf then I have the Studio Waste streetwear maybelline satin skin all my bottle foundation are kept on this last final case and so this is how the whole uh, tray look like and yeah i lost the focus a bit in this particular holder at the back i keep my crayon form lip balms and yeah they are pretty much then at the back i have this diy tray where i keep my random brands of nail polishes the right hand side and the front is my Nykaa nail polishes then on the left hand side I have mostly Lacme, Cougio, Blue Heaven and in the mid section I have all my Color Essence nail polishes and also the mini form of Faces and Color Essence nail polish. On the right at the top I have a worn nail polishes and on the left hand side I have few mixed brand. I keep all my Color Show nail polish in this separate box because it's easier for me to grab one and find one. This is just a box which I got with the, from the brand Arrow. Yeah, I stored this box on top of the nail polish tray which is easier for me to grab one. I keep all my compact in this white tray and I have like Maybelline, Star Cosmetic, L'Oreal, L18, Maybelline, Maybelline. I keep two of my blush. This is a Sivana blush out here because I that particular blush tray didn't have any space. Then I have Rimmel and this is also a bronzer which is the Oriflame Very Me bronzer. Then I keep all my makeup brushes at the back and then the front is my Nivea After Shave Balm. The, the smaller, this particular green one consists of my smaller brushes and the yellow one and the midsection one have all my bigger makeup brush. Pretty much all the makeup brushes which I owe. Then I love this Neva Men Sensitive Balm and this is a DIY uh, box which I used to keep all my liquid lipstick and lip glosses. Mostly it comprises of liquid lipstick and few random lip glosses. I have brand like Shimbor, uh, Diana of London, then Color Sense, LA Girl, Miss Claire, then Erasia in Color, Avon, yeah quite a number of brands then i keep all my bullet lipstick in this particular box which i received with a cookies yes this was a box full of cookies earlier i have like all random brands the uh, this section consists of all my l'oreal lacme sugar this is the new sugar 70s red lipstick which i purchased lately in maybelline avon maybelline maybelline streetwear blue heaven color sense makeup revolution uh, Palladio, Color Bar, Lacme, Melon, all, all sort of random brands. Yes, pretty much. These are all Avons. Yeah, pretty much all random brand. I have three MAC lipstick in Morange, Ruby Rue and 
yes uh flat out fabulous i guess the third one then i keep my l18 lipstick in this separate tray because they are pretty bulky in nature so yeah i have this l18 color boost color pop color burst and the matte collection as well in this particular tray i also keep my blue heaven moa lipstick in there then i have the three faces dust takeables or eye pigments these are all my lip crayons which i keep in a holder at the back of this dust stakeable these are all my lip gradation i have like random brand like color bar savanna pretty much this is my l'oreal infallible uh, makeup fixer i have only one makeup fixer right now then this two particular holder have all my mascara i have like maybelline maybelline l'oreal rimmel color bar blue heaven lacme pretty much all sort of random brand then essence Pretty much all the mascaras which I have, I keep in these two holders. Then at the back, coffee mug in which I keep all my brushes, my round brush, paddle brush, pretty much all my brush. Next to it, I have a pack full of cotton pads. Then on the top of this uh, particular bag, you can see all my makeup pouches which I received with my fab bag. Then in this particular red box, I keep my smaller eyeshadow palettes or mono eyeshadow palettes or quartets i have like studio waste lotus essence lacme 925 blue heaven maybelline emua makeup revolution color sense yeah pretty much a lot of random brands are there then this magazine holder is used for by me to keep bigger eyeshadow palettes i also store few random products on top like my blush and my pack beauty blender which you can see and also the music flower uh gel liner which i've kept there to store for the moment or for right now i have like maybelline the nude palette tintin eyeshadow palette a lot of makeup revolution makeup revolution at the back i have the chameleon makeup kit Then I again have a uh, Nika K Nika K New York. Then the Freedom Pro Blush Palette, and yeah, pretty much all the palettes like Emua, mostly Makeup Revolution, Elf, pretty much all my bigger palettes. Then I store few of my makeup in these two cosmetic bags. On the right hand side, I'll first go with the orange bag, and I keep all my highlighters, brow kits, and my bronzer in this particular. make a bag because yeah it's work well for me i have like a uh, random brands like sivana makeup revolution blue heaven emua freedom uh then wet and wild then i can see the freedom pro contour then the kudos yeah pretty much and then that is the elf brow kit this is essence brow kit this is a essence eye shadow which i use as a as a highlighter so i kept it there then i have all my bricks that is the sivana color bricks and my revlon brick and also my Re makeup revolution eye brow kit as well from jordani pearl and my uh, star cosmetic highlighter and my essence bronzer as well in this particular box then in the next particular makeup box and the first section i have all my bigger concealer palette like kudos kiss beauty A ads then cal and also a backup of the maybelline fit me foundation a lot of you ask me my shade my shade is toffee caramel 330 and this is a backup of the fit me foundation i also keep a, a random cover of my lipstick in this particular case which i store until i review the product yeah so i kept it and on the lower section i keep some random products like bobby pins a few of my makeup remover this baby lips lip bloom which i recently purchased then my eyelash curlers two extra beauty blenders all my sharpeners and i also stored this organic harvest lip balm because they are bulky in nature so that is pretty much what all my makeup collection looks like i hope you guys really enjoy this and yeah that is pretty much i hope you guys really enjoy this video and if you do please do not forget to give it a big thumbs up do comment and subscribe i know i have shared a lot of product there might be few products on which i haven't even done a video yet in case you want me to do any sort of video whether makeup tutorial impression or review on any particular product you have watched in my collection do let me know in the comment section below i would love to do that for you guys and yeah that is pretty much I won't ramble a lot because I think I have taken a lot of your time already. So you guys stay beautiful always and have a great day ahead. Until next time.
Bye.